Hey folks, happy Monday to you. We come to our second to last day of the Elevation Prayer Calendar in February. It is Monday, February 27th. The encouragement is for us to read John chapter 19, verses 16 through 30. I'm going to leave you to do that. What I want to do is I want to encourage you uh, to read the crucifixion story in each of the four Gospels. Each one is a little bit different, a little bit different perspective in the same way that if you and I witnessed the same event and we shared that, uh, shared sort of our takeaway from that event, yours would be a little bit different than mine. Um, so different perspectives, we get to see a broader, fuller picture. My favorite line in all of the crucifixion stories is this, and it comes from the Gospel of Luke. Father, into your hands I commend my spirit, that Jesus finally relents on the cross. He's going to die. Uh, he's prayed in the garden that, that God would take this cup from him, but that is not God's will. And in the end, he commends his spirit. He gives him his full self over to God in this act of death. And I love that line. It goes with the prayer prompt for today. The prayer prompt says, fulfillment of prophecies about Jesus' crucifixion. Even in these darkest hours, God is present and is still drawing us to him. God is present and is still drawing us to him. And when I hear, Father, I've, I commend my spirit into your hands, I commend my spirit. I It takes me back to the passage in John in which Jesus is talking about being the branch and the vines so that God is the root, uh, the trunk of this tree and Jesus is the, the branch that comes off. And then we are these vines that grow beyond that. And that if when once we stay connected to Jesus, that we are connected to God and the connection happens here on the cross that Jesus commends his spirit into the hands of God. And as we're connected to Jesus, we get drawn into the commending of that spirit. We get drawn into God by Jesus um, and uh, what uh, he does there and. That's really a great image for Lent, that as we stay connected to Jesus and he, he commends his spirit to God, that we're drawn into the fullness of God. So uh, that is the promise, that's the fulfillment of this promise, as it says here, that uh, God is present and is still drawing us to him. He does that uh, through Jesus' commendation of his spirit to God on the cross. I pray this day that you feel drawn to God. God bless you. Have a great day.